Hey Scrapping Divas, this is Anna coming to you today with a new project and um, it's just a just because project. I had all my stuff set out and I really felt like working with yellow which is one of my favorite colors. It's the number one of the top three colors <laughs> with orange and green so actually you're gonna see all three of those colors um, really put into this project. So with further ado, okay, here we go. So, I had decorated a jar very similar to this one a while ago, and I submitted it for my Wild Orchid Crafts when um, I had t attempted to be on the design team. So, I wanted to do another one. So, these right here are jars that you um, get from Trader Joe's. My friend, she buys syrup in these um, jars. I don't know. I mean, I mean, really, does it cover like four pancakes at the most? It's so small. I get like Log Cabin or Aunt Jemima, like the really big size ones. But, um, so she gives me these jars and I love them because they're really cute. So, um, I wanted to go ahead and alter it. So, all of these are I Am Roses. I have hoarded these flowers since mm, last year. <laughs> And I'm going to need to place an order with them. It is very hard. I really do love their flowers. They have like the huge array of colors and sizes and different styles. So when I had got these packages, since they were my favorite colors, I never used them until today. So I went ahead, and I don't know names, sizes, any of that fun stuff. But this is what I have. <laughs> this right here is one of those cabochon type thingy or whatever they're called. I got that from Elaine. Hi Elaine! And my, one of my goodie packages out of the many she sent me. <laughs> so I used that in there. It was beautiful. These little sprays right here that you see popping out through here. There's some right here. Here. Oops, I'm sorry. That's the flower. Right there. <laughs> and here. Those are sprays from Michaels. Let me move slowly. You see I have over there, I have a bunch of those little sprays. Anytime I see it in the different change of seasons and stuff like that, I always buy them. Because for me, I don't care about season colors. If I want to use that color, regardless if it's winter and I want to use fall colors or summer and I want to, in, in winter I want to use summer colors, I do that. It's whatever I feel. I don't go based on season. So those are fall colors from uh, that I purchased much earlier in the year. So um, actually, maybe last year. Heck, I don't know. So, I decided to go ahead and use those. I made this stick pen. This right here is one of the Michaels um, Bling Butterflies. They're so adorable. I finally busted it open and used one of them. This right here, I don't remember what sheet it's from. They had a bunch of these images on it, and I used my stamp. Um, I have a punch that makes this stamp decoration. So I put that, it says home sweet home, I put blings in the corner. This lace right here, this beautiful fab lace, I bought it from a fabric store that I found. It's a little hole in the wall place. Oh my gosh, adore it. I spent $10 and I can't even tell you how much lace I got because there was like 29 cents a yard and just crazy amounts. I mean, I loved it. So I have to go back because I'm going to be doing a giveaway. Um, because you guys are so awesome and I have so many new subbies all the time now. I'm so honored, like seriously. So I'm going to do three giveaways because I can't just do one. So I'm going to do three. They're not going to be anything like super major, but they're going to be fun, yummy stuff that you guys will all love. And this t and, and lace from my fabric store that I found, that's going to be one of them. So, okay. This right here is fiber. I just tied it around. This bling I got from Elaine. I have some of these blings too, but I don't think I have this small size. So I used it. I tied it on. Thank you, Elaine. Then right here, these safety pins are awesome. They're kind of like the garment pins. I need to get some of those. I have none of those because they don't have the little loop at the bottom so you can hang charms. Love it. This was from the Industrial Chicks at Michael's. I bought a pack of them. And then just a little charm. I believe I got this from Creative Chloe when she was um, selling her bunches of super awesome charms. And I bought like a bunch from her. I miss her. I need to find out where she's at. 
And then back here is Nestabilities. It's a Nestability die I used. And I used the, it's a Prima line. The Anna, Prima, oh, I don't remember. <laughs> I'm not good with names like that. I'm so bad with it. And then these are also another couple of the same type of, from the front of the page. I just cut out, punched out two more. I didn't do too much decoration because the focal point is going to be in the front, but I wanted something to be in the back that coordinated with the front. So all I did was tie this big, it was like two inches wide, and I just wrapped it around and tied it on the side. I did not glue it right here because this I believe right here, no, it's not. I thought it was a stretchy one, but it's not. Um, I just, uh, I wanted to do something a little different, and I thought that would be cute just to tie it. So you see that it's not, so I, if I needed to move it, I can. It's not glued down like that. But I do have all my flowers and all that stuff glued down, so um, this isn't going nowhere. <laughs> so that's it. This is just one of my little altered items that I wanted to show everybody. I did not put anything on top, and the reason why, oh, you can't see them, is because I have all my yummies in it. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> these are little flatback yummies from Saw Crafters. I absolutely love these. I love them. So I have the greens and a peach and I have cream colors right here. So I have an array of colors and, and what's funny is that all the ones that I purchased from her happen to match the colors that are in the jar. So that's what's all in here so we could store them instead of keeping them in plastic. So I thought, oh, that would be pretty. So that's what I created it for. I do have another altered, I have like mojo today, it's insane. So I do have another project I'm working on, it's more of an altered type box with some more yummies. So I will be back and showing you that, maybe today or tomorrow, we'll see how fast I get it done. And um, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for stopping by, showing love. And some that just stop by and don't leave comments, I thank you for stopping by anyways. So I will see you guys soon. You guys have a super awesome day. Mucho hugs. Bye.